Hello friends! In today's video, I will do an unboxing of this Winter Magic tape set. And we're going to do a real quick page with these stickers. Hi, my name is Belinda. I'm the founder of Organizing Blessed Mom. And I'm back with another creative idea. If you're new here, please subscribe and turn on the notifications so you will know when a new video is posted. Friends, I wanted to go ahead and unbox this beautiful tape set with you. I brought you uh, not too long ago the Cozy Autumn tape set, but Fayware has just released this Winter Magic tape set. So in this box, we have four PET tapes and they are Christmas and winter uh, related. You can find uh, this product on Amazon and I will leave down here in the description box the my affiliate link to Amazon so that you can go and get this box. So I'm very excited. I've already peaked because I could not wait to see these uh, beautiful tapes in person. So uh, to begin with, she did include um, another set of like stickers. These are washi stickers, they're on white and have this really pretty winter scene. And of course, the little thank you. And I thought there was something else. I think there is. If I'm not mistaken, there's something else. Let me check. All right, here we go. I thought I had seen something else, but it got stuck inside the box here. So these are some really cute, um, just Christmas and winter stickers. This one says hot chocolate weather, and then let's stay cozy. And this really pretty, just a girl who loves winter um, icons. Just I thought these were so, so pretty. Um, and so the this one and this one come at the top here and then the card all right so now let's get into the tapes here i'm just going to show you so let's start with i think what i this is like a christmas one so i believe it's like two two or three christmas and one that is winter let me see if i can put this white paper here so let's find the repeat real quick. So I have this girl with the with the tree and it keeps on going until so this is the length of the repeat right here. It has a lot of different and beautiful um, scenes. So we have here a girl decorating the Christmas tree. Then we have some bows, another girl carrying a tree. Here is like some hands with some hot cocoa. Then here is like, this is a really big one. It's like a couple and they have their Christmas tree. Just so, so pretty. Someone writing down maybe like a Christmas list. Another person with a tree, a hand and a wreath. Here's a couple in their cozy, cozy sweaters. Here is another couple with their tree. Another girl here with the, her winter attire, some bows. We have here a girl with her pretty um, hair. Another girl with a cup, a hot drink. Another girl with her sweater and her hot drink, more bows. We have a beautiful Christmas tree. I love this one. Here is um, just a hand with a list, some cozy socks, happy mail, a lot of bows, some cozy socks. Here is a Christmas tree, a hand with maybe that might be like, a, could that be like a snow heart? <laughs> Um, some hands with hot chocolate or some kind of hot drink. A girl here, a bow. This one is a girl with a present, so pretty. Here is the um, letters to Santa post, a little mailbox. We have a girl here with a gift, a girl in her cozy sweater, a couple arriving at a door, 
we have here a snowman and then it just repeats so such pretty images but let's keep on um so this would be let me know if you like this one i'm gonna call this one um roll number one so if you like roll number one let me know so let's go to roll number two here is what i'm calling roll number two and this is also very very christmasy like so let's go ahead and find a repeat here is that girl with gifts the repeat is pretty pretty long yeah so here is your it won't get repeat until here so a lot of stickers in this pack beautiful stickers so we have here a girl with uh, some gifts, a wreath, a lot of stars, another girl here with uh, the Christmas tree, some candy canes, hands um, like wrapping a gift. We have here a gift, some more hands doing like a craft. We have here some like greenery, Christmas greenery, another girl by the tree. We have some roses, red and white. We have some florals here, a bow, also another wreath. This one has a lot of wreaths in it, for sure. Here is a girl with a wreath. Here is a girl wrapping some gifts. We have here roses, a tree lit up. We have a girl with her hot chocolate and some, that's an envelope and some star cookies. Here is the girl, here's a different, it's very similar, but it's another girl with her gift but she has a different skin tone here is some greenery some roses another girl with her drink a tree a girl with a gift some flowers a package here's the girl sitting down with a drink hands wrapping gifts even with wrapping paper so cute a little package a gift package here we have a tree inside a bucket, a little bit of uh, some a branch, a girl with her wreath, and then we come back to the beginning. So this is what I'm gonna call uh, washi roll number number two. And so these are PET tapes, and so you just cut around and then just peel off. So let me know, do you like number two? Let's go on to number three. Here's what I'm calling number three. This is tape number three. We're gonna go find the repeat. This is a girl here. And where's the repeat? So the repeat is way up here. Lots and lots of goodies. So this one is, I could tell right now, has a lot of red and it does have a little bit more wintry thing. So we have here a girl with her high heels. Um, a snowman, we have a tree, some bows, a, a snowman snow globe, some uh, birds on their birdhouse with snow, candy cane, a light post all decked up for, for Christmas. We have a sled, a bird, a package, even some um, ornaments, some ornaments in this one. Another red bird, some little um, Christmas foliage there, a uh, Santa hat, some candy cane. Oh, look at these mugs. These mugs have little reindeer and you have more mugs here like apple cider maybe and something, maybe a hot cocoa there, another mug there. We have here like um, a lantern, hot cocoa, a dog, a nutcracker, a Santa mailbox. Look at this girl. This girl is ready. She has her wreath and all her really pretty clothing. I love this one. This one is like a storefront. Beautiful, I love that one. Um, what are these called? <laughs> a gnome? A gnome, I think. Uh, here is a banner. And then, um, what is this? Oh, it's like uh, ski sleds, right? And they're like, they have a really pretty um, wreath around them. Here's a, a couple with their tree, ice skates, and uh, the can't go wrong with the red truck, right? 
we have some little branches there here is a mom and uh, a child and then a doggy some more branches some holly a little tree and then we have a lot of poinsettias in this one plus trees plus what looks like um some kind of little decoration there more trees and then we get to the girl so lots so i'm gonna call this uh tape number three do you like this one i really love these two images i'm going to use those really fast all right and the last tape here of this four tape set is more of a wintry uh tape set i'm so glad that she did include something more for like those Janu January spreads that we do. So let's find the repeat here is the polar bears. This one's really pretty. So all of them, I don't even know which one I would say is my favorite. This one has a lot of blues and whites, also neutrals. Uh, so we have here polar bears and we have some snowflakes. We also have a really pretty uh, tree with a lot of snow more snowflakes we have bows penguins deer snowman gnomes ornaments letters gnomes bows dogs here we have some gingerbread men a sleigh gingerbread houses um looks like some kind of a fruity or like christmasy drink uh, a really nice uh, neutral wreath a real neutral tree this is real pretty these white flowers and the sweater and then the white skate and you have a lot of mittens and like hats and oh my god this is one of my favorites uh this ballerina and we have a skate a blue skate a girl in this really beautiful pink coat look at this house really pretty blue house we have a more of a neutral house and then we have a lot of these really pretty blue wintry flowers and then we're up to the beginning isn't this just a beautiful tape so do you like this tape this is what i'm calling tape number four <laughs> has more of a wintry feel but still has some, um, I would say this is more winter like but let me know in the comments down below if you like this one all right for this next part I'm going to make a real quick uh, sheet for my memory journal for December and I want to use this girl and this storefront right there so I'm going to go so I keep all my Christmas washing in one uh, bin so that I can just pull it out when it's time for Christmas. And I'm just trying to find something in this, um, in those colors. I don't think they have much of a pink. I'm just trying to find, this is just a collection of all kinds of different washi tape that I've had from different, um, year so i think these are probably the best fit of washies here just all kinds of washi um like i think some of these are vicky Boden, some of these are simple stories so i do like the green i'm just not sure if i like which green and i do want to do a, a red i don't have much reds actually yeah, I don't have much red. I guess I could go with the ho ho ho. So something like that. Um, and that's kind of how I like to do it. I like to put, I'm going to have to, I want to cover <laughs> this uh, big, this one's pretty too. Maybe these. I want to cover this big part with some kind of washi. Um, I did an unboxing of this Happy Planner pack and I'm just going to cover it. I'm not going to white it out or anything. I think it's good enough here. 
so that looks a little bit more festive maybe i'll layer here this guy underneath just a little layering and then i probably want to put something else down here kind of liking this or this one okay i'm gonna go with this one because it's wider i probably should have done this one at the top because it would have covered more but we're just going with it it's just a real quick page and i'm just gonna put that down here there is a little bit of gray down here and i'm gonna cover it oh i don't want to go anyways i got into the little I got into the groove there, but that's all right. Okay, so now it's just real easy. Once I have my washi down, I just go and pick the images that I like. So I'm just gonna come in here and cut off this image. So you can do it all kinds of ways. I just, for ease of this video, I'm going to just slice it off there. This is the part that I don't like because <laughs> it takes so long. So I did, the beauty of these PET tapes is that um, you kind of, you can play around with the placement and it's really fun. Now on these sheets that I make, I don't, um, I don't embellish it too much because I the whole purpose of the sheet is to have writing and I just make these clusters to kind of help the the writing go around those clusters so I'm gonna place this guy down here at the bottom because he is the biggest guy and I usually like to get really close to the the edge of the sticker because I write around these stickers and I like that down here we already have a base I kind of like to give my stickers some kind of a resting place for them so here we go and here I'm gonna rest this guy right here and then I'm gonna put this one over. I'm just gonna cut a little bit. You can also use an X-Acto knife to get real close. I just, oh, almost tore out. I'm moving too fast. Just cut off. Because I write around these stickers, I kinda don't want too much of a, edge and then usually what I like to do also is give it a base so I'm just going to I'm going to re reuse this guy here and put it right here cut it like that and then I can just sit the mailbox on top of it it just gives my thing a base. You can also do like little clusters. Um, but since I don't really need the purpose of the journal is to journal about my everyday memories. I don't really need much decorating. I need more writing space. And so I really want to take off as much of this plastic as I can so that I can write around the, um, the sticker. Oh, these little plastic things get a little annoying sometimes. All right, so I'm going to put her there. Maybe I'll put this red one. Well, it'll match with her shoes. Do I want to contrast? Yeah, I'll just go with red. I have different size washies, and so 
kind of nice to have to be able to use these again they've been in storage for quite a while all right so let's stick this curl just want to peel up the edge there and then it comes right off okay so we're gonna put her here so pretty all right so that is how i would do my page the only other thing i need is to stamp in the date see when you stamp the date it all starts looking really nice so i make a page like this so i am using these are mail by mail uh, stamps they're called list builder christine small numbers and i'm using the katherine pooler um december is that what's called yeah december stamp set i have this i have these she makes one of these for every month and i use it like crazy let's see i think i'm gonna go with this december I could go with the small one, but I think I like this one. So I already prepped my stamps. And I'm just going to stamp here December 1st. And then my, my sheet will be ready to start journaling. So I always go with black, this black, unless it's a special thing. Black goes with everything. So I'm gonna stamp here. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna go as much into the edge as I, as I can. These pages, I do put them into my, um, into a happy planner. I have here a, a little lawn, lawn fawn chamois that I use to clean off my stamps. And then let's put December 1st. So I do put um, these sheets in a happy planner. And I like the versatility of the happy planner because you can take out the sheet and do your, you know, your adjustments or your whatever sheet you're working on. You can just work on it. And there we have it. I am ready here. I got enough space to write uh, around these things. So that's what I'll, I'll do. Um, I decorate my week on the weekend. And so I make these pages, about seven pages. And then I am ready to journal on that particular day. So. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope that you liked uh, all these different washi tapes that come in this beautiful uh, winter magic tape set. Let me know which one is the one that you enjoyed. There's so many things you can do with these. I use them in my journals and in my planners. And I think this, um, this is gonna be a great a great set to have in your collection i'll leave the link down below in the description box i hope you enjoyed uh, just seeing and unboxing this with me and then making this beautiful beautiful page to use in my journals so as always if you like the video please give me a like and if you have any questions or comments about what i shared just let me know down below in the comments all right friends i'll see you in the next one Bye bye